LV VV. Drop the bomb on this one. That bomb right there is the mother of all stock bombs that we just seen coming off of that uh, April 11th, bouncing off that bottom right here with a move of an open at 0022 and a high of 0043 and the close at 0043. The following day on the 12th, opened at 0043 and closed at 0046 and again opened at 0046. So all you guys that are watching this, Right now, and I talk about these gap ups. How many times do I say avoid gaps? I say it all the time. This stock right here avoided every gap. There is not one single gap in here. And look at that coming from the 0022 area uh, that closed on the previous day of uh, 410 and then 411. You guys closed that there. You guys got outside that lower Bollinger band. The volume started picking up. Look at that nice steady volume picking up here. This is just a perfect picture, uh, picture perfect uh, chart right here. I mean, really, my personal opinion, beautiful move. So for this is going to be that example that I talk about. The penny stock, uh, penny stock gap ups don't do this. That video that I did, a lot of people uh, talk about it. A lot of people share that video. You guys avoided every single gap. And that's what happens. 0022, three days all the way up at 0057. Just a beautiful move. That momentum and that volume is continuously picking up. So we're going to avoid these gaps. My personal opinion, the way that it's currently at right now with the RSI at 60, off of that complete beatdown, hitting that low of 34 over here on the 10th was the lowest that RSI hit. That volume picking up in the RSI at 60. I personally believe it could go much higher especially with the break 0065. If you guys end up breaking, uh, this one right now is at 0073 is gonna be the top out of that uh, right there. We'll see that right there. 0073, watch. In my opinion, it's not gonna take too much going up further from here. I mean, it's not overextended yet. I think that it could keep going from here. You guys did have a trend line here as well. Uh, again, I apologize. I know that this one's kind of detailed here with uh, the stock chart. Um, I'm just trying to make sure I cover all the bases here as possible. So if we go ahead and move this one down to make sure we align with those candlesticks that I'm looking at here and here, look at that. So right there is going to be your trend line. It's moved up, come down to the uh, trend line, broke the 30-day simple moving average, plowed right past it up to 0073, nice come down right over here on uh, April 3rd, broke through that trend line, everything started falling apart, came down to that bottom support, uh, down here around the 2-0 area, 2-2, two, two, I'm going to call it 2-0, right there in that general area, and just plowed right off of that. So, uh, great job, really nice return off that beatdown, break that trend day, uh, trending, uh, the trend line. My personal opinion, things are looking way better here. They really are. I mean, that volume, nice and steady pickup. So, thank you very much for bringing this to us over here on Investors Hangout. Uh, again, at 0057, uh, a beautiful close at that high of day right here. Watch for that volume to continue and avoid any gaps. Remember, avoid them gaps. <clears throat> All right, so um, these guys right here, they got the uh, stop sign with the pink no information. So I'm limited on what I can pull up on them and let's see what they got for their uh, share structure. They had a press release on February 2nd, 2017 as well. It was a uh, live wire. Ergogenics announces short run manufacturing capabilities and launch of all natural product line. The live wire Ergo, Ergo, Ergogenics Incorporated, the leader in performance based functional chew development and marketing, announced on February 2nd a, the modification of its manufacturing process to include short run car capabilities. I mean, I think we went over that before. It seems familiar to me. All right, so uh, that's that, and let's see what they got. All right, so the authorized as of March 23rd, 2016 was uh, 1,500,000,000 shares. And then the float as of November 20th, 2015 was 366,578,284,000 shares. Um, so that's pretty much it. I'm limited on the information over here because of that. Yeah, just nothing there. All right, um, if you have an opinion on the company, just go right over that LVVV board and share it with the tens of thousands of like-minded investors that we have using the site daily.
All right, and all that information that Joe was just giving you and he was pulling up, I can go ahead and pull that up really quick just so you guys can see it. Uh, over here, you guys have the news and stuff pops out right at you, all the news articles right here. Uh, on that page that we're looking at right here, and with that being said, if we take a look at right now, uh, the chart 0057 watch, in my opinion, has much more room to go here and avoid gaps. Resistance at 00665 and 73, which is going to be that top that we see over here. Support at 0045402020. Yes, that's a big move. Uh, if you guys break it down here, it could come down just as fast here. Uh, I, I would put this one on a technical analysis alert, but I'm not going to just because of the fact that it's already had the three-day run. I don't feel that, uh, you know, I, I like to call them down at the bottom. I would have never seen this move coming. If I would have looked at this, I would have told you right here on the 10th, watch for a pullback into the lower Bollinger Band, uh, but nothing to compare to what you've seen here. So LVV. V. If you follow this one, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you haven't already, we would appreciate it very much. And most importantly, get out there and share this video with all other investors. The more you share it, the more it's requested, the more we will continue to cover this one moving forward. And with that being said, if you'd like to join in on our next live stream, you can join us at investorshangout.com forward slash live. And uh, I just added one more line of support in here at 5.5. I looked at it over here. There is one more in here, but below that's going to be that 30-day. Uh, so keep that in mind as well. LVBV. Watch it.